good morning everyone today is tuesday and it's about nine o'clock in the morning and um, so this is part two of me redoing my room if you haven't seen part one then i'll link it down below in the description so this is what my bedroom currently looks like i've just got a few bits and bobs here and everything that's on my desk and underneath my desk needs to be moved today because my desk is going to be going downstairs because it's going to be collected by a council tomorrow and um, my mattress is on the floor at the moment because yesterday i broke down my bed so it looks quite sunny outside today so i've just popped on this shirt and i've worn it twice in the past few weeks and a lot of you guys have been commenting saying that you really like this shirt i don't know why um but i thought i would wear it again today so today i actually have an appointment at 10 so i'm going to be going into the town center and i might pop into primark pound stretcher and i need to go to the post office so i'm out now and this is the box that i need to send off to the post office <laughs> hours since I last spoke to you guys so when I got home I helped my mum move some stuff into the cupboard my sister came round helped me and my mum bring all the pieces of furniture downstairs so the desk is gone um I've got some stuff on the hamster cage and I've got all of these stuff so I'm just gonna sort them out a bit and then pop them in that corner over there so I did go through all of my makeup drawers the other day I did actually um go through all the stuff in my room um a few weeks ago so it's all been you know tidied up and everything what needs to go in the bin has already gone in the bin and then as i'm going through everything again then whatever i feel like i can really get rid of can just be chucked away look who's just come out of her house <laughs> she is so cute hello cashmere unfortunately i can't pick you up because you've got a lot of stuff on top of your cage right now my sister was going through these baskets to see if there was any makeup products that she wants so she's going to be keeping all of this i think she says she's going to be keeping all of this and then um, these stuff she doesn't want so i'm just going to keep them somewhere for now so i've just got changed into some comfy clothes i've just got the shorts on which are from primark i love them and i've just popped on this vest top thing which is also from primark to be doing much else for the rest of the day i'm gonna be having my dinner in a little bit and i'm gonna go ahead and take my makeup off and have a quick shower um and then tomorrow i'm not too sure what's going to be going on tomorrow last night i ordered my bedside table that's the only furniture item i've ordered so far so yeah i'm gonna end today's vlog here so good morning everyone today i'm going to be taking everything out of my wardrobe so this morning the council came to collect my furniture i'm at 5 30 in the morning which is really really early um i got up to get a drink of water and i looked out the window and i saw them dragging my desk and my mattress and stuff <sighs> Oh, 
so i've just taken everything off um the top of my wardrobe that was all my hamster stuff so that's now in the living room so now i'm going to start taking out everything that's in my wardrobe so i've got my bags at the top got all of my um jumpers and my leather jacket and then i've got a few bits and bobs down there and in this wardrobe i've got some more of my bags at the top i've got some hair stuff um with some of my coats my mum's coats and cardigans and some more bags and a few other random bits and bobs I've finished emptying the wardrobes now so this is what it looks like empty so this is what my bedroom looks like right now it is such a mess so I'm not too sure when but um, me and my mum are going to be moving the wardrobes out my room at some point today with my niece um, my niece had an appointment and I had to go um, to Primark to Good. exchange two items because I got them in the wrong size um, so we're just waiting for my sister to come back now and then we're gonna go off to get my nephews from school this is um go buy it and tell what you think So I picked up the Innocent Bubble Sparkling Lemon and Lime Pure Fruit and Spring Water. I've seen this advertising on YouTube for the past week or so um, and it sounded really really nice. Um, so when I saw it today in Tesco's I thought I would pick it up. This actually cost £1 something um, but I was kind of expecting it to be like a pound or something like that. So I also have this um, gluten free chocolate brownie because my sister eats gluten free things and she got two of these and she didn't really want this one so I thought I would eat it. So I got this in the post when I was leaving out and it's just this little knob and this is to go on my bedside table it is so 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 pretty I got it so that it could match my bed frame because it has like these little crystals on it um, my bedside table actually arrived today um, but I was in the bath when it arrived so my mum took the parcel in because I was in the rush I didn't have the chance to open up the parcel but I'm definitely going to do that on camera when I get home so my sister and my niece have gone to pick up my nephews so I'm just waiting for them in the car and they're taking ages so as my sister and my niece are taking a little while I thought I would show you guys the two items that I exchanged today from Primark so I did go Primark yesterday and I've got a couple of things one of the items that I got were these bras um, it's just a pack of free plain black bras um, I'm normally a size 34A and I've been wearing that size for god knows how many years um, and yesterday I picked up a 35A pack but then one of the bras was a 34B so I thought I would just try it on and it actually fits so all this time I've been wearing the wrong size so I went ahead and exchanged it for a 34B um, and I also picked up these adorable miffy trousers um yesterday i accidentally picked them up in the wrong size i got a size 14 to 16 um and then today i just went back and got a size 4 and i believe this was eight pounds and these bras were also eight pounds oh, God, no, so you can't really see me too well right now but yeah you can um so we've just got to my sister's house and we're now going indoors look at her on snapchat <laughs> is a toy that I gave to Fudge because I didn't need one. He's so cute. Oh, I love Hello, you. Fudge. You're so cute. Hey, baby. How much you sleep? I'm yeah. at my sister's house now and hi, Shanice. Um, she's hi. with Fudge. I'm going to go ahead and try this drink now. 
Um, Shanice got one as well, but she didn't really like it. It smells really, really weird. It actually tastes really nice. Like, it's nothing special. And it doesn't have that, that, that much taste. But it does taste really, really good though. But I don't think I would buy it again, especially for the price. But, you know, it's quite nice. It doesn't taste anything like lemon and lime. It kind of tastes more like apple juice with like sparkling water but it's really nice though so i thought i would give you guys a really quick outfit of the day so as usual i just have my black cap on i have this really pretty choker on i have this black laced bralette with this cardigan with like these tassely bits on it and then i just have on some black leggings so i think it's about six o'clock and i'm currently just in my sister's room um editing this vlog um it's still quite bright and sunny outside which is really good um, i'm not too sure what time i'm going to start walking home maybe in about an hour or two once my sister gets back <laughs> So I'm now home and it's about 8.30 so I just hoovered the corner where my wardrobes were because earlier me and my mum moved them into her room. I'm going to put all of my stuff that was in the wardrobe on the floor over there for now. Sorry if the lighting is really bad because it's getting quite dark now. So this is the box that my bedside table came in. I'm going to go ahead and open this up now and see what I think of it. So this is going to be my first piece of white furniture. I'm super excited but I'm also really really nervous. So here it is, my first piece of white furniture. I love it. For some reason, I feel like it looked a little bit different on the picture. I don't remember these little bits, but they don't look too bad. The drawer seems to be in back to front, I think, because it's not pulling out that way. So here's the drawer. It is quite deep, which is good, so I can fit quite a few bits in here. So there we go. I like it. It was the wrong way around. I like it. It looks really, really good. What I really want to do is to try and change the um, knob to this one. Yay, I've done it. So I changed the handle and oh my god, is this not pretty? I love it. I'm so excited to get the rest of my furniture now. So I'm going to go ahead and pop this back in the box because I don't want to leave it out in case it gets ruined or dirty. So goodbye bedside table. So it's almost 10 o'clock and I'm feeling absolutely shattered. I've been out and about today and I've been doing quite a few bits and bobs. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and take my makeup off and me and my mum are going to be having Chinese for dinner. So tomorrow my sister might be taking me and my mum to have a look at some carpets in the morning. I'm really hoping that we go to the carpet shop because we've been meaning to go to another one for a good couple of days now. I'm going to be ordering my furniture tonight so my furniture is going to be from Ikea and the range. Um, I've still got my chest of drawers in my bedroom so that's the last pieces of furniture which need to be um, taken out my room. So I'm really excited to get the rest of my furniture. The only thing I'm worried about is the fact that I feel like I have too much stuff. Um, even though I've gone through everything I do have quite a lot of items and I don't want to like do my room up and then I'm going to have things just sitting around without anywhere to go. Um, there's a lot of things that I want to put under my bed but there's only so much just going to be able to um, fit under there and even with my old furniture I struggled to find like a space to put things so that's the only thing I'm you know kind of worried about so that's it for this video I hope you guys enjoyed watching it don't forget to check out my social medias which will be linked down below as well as my website for small animal subscription boxes and I'll see you guys in my next video so bye for now